Alrighty, oh, we are back. We were, last we left off, we just finished figuring out the ship. And we were gonna head into the next escape room to figure out. And you get to watch me struggle through that. Um, I will be taking like a quick second in like 20-ish minutes or so. I've got some stuff in the oven I gotta pull. But I will be back. It won't, like, I won't even need the break video. It'll just take me, like, a minute. Anyway, let's get started, shall we? Alrighty. What am I looking at other than a hole? So I am looking at a hole in here. Oh my gosh, it is so dark. It won't let me click anywhere. What am I supposed to be doing? Ah! There is stuff. Okay. There is a thing that's pointing upward, but it won't let me click on- Oh. Okay. I found a metal bar. And that's what lets me into the room. Okay! Nope, that makes all the sense. Um, we're in a Mesoamerican tomb? I think that because this looks like kind of like maybe a Mesoamerican design, but I could be wrong. Okay. I got a small wooden handle for whatever that's worth. Anything I should be looking for? Uh... No. Okay. Ah! Pierce the eye. Well, that sounds pleasant. Can I click on the words? No, it's just instructions. Cool, pleasant, delightful sounding. Okay. Okay, cool. I have a small token, a wooden handle, and a metal bar. Oh boy. Um. No idea what we're doing with that. It won't let. Weird pillar up here. No, okay, we got a golden tower. Don't know what we're doing with it, but we got probably putting it on top. Anyway, before we move on. <clears throat> Another room, another door, another room. Either you are as lost as I, or more likely, you have forsaken me. Another room, another door. Yet ever a pang of hunger. Not Yet never a pang of hunger, nor the welcome respite of sleep. I keep a tally in my ledger, but I can no longer count the marks. I count the pages. The writing keeps keeps me sane. I tell myself I did not deserve this hell. All right then. He's going crazy. He's going crazy. Okay. I don't know what you want me to do with that yet, game. That's fine. Alright, so I feel like we're probably putting the tower up here. No? Are we not? No, the base is all wrong. Okay. 
Something definitely is going up top there, right? Like, absolutely. But nothing that is in my inventory. Cool. Cool. Is that the eye we're supposed to pierce? Because it said I was supposed to pierce the eye. But I see no eye around with which to pierce. Or of which to pierce, I suppose, would be the term. I see no eye around here of which to pierce. So... Also, who keeps these torches burning? Shouldn't I have to relight them? To be able to see? Unless we're saying the other guy was here before me, in which case maybe he lit the torches? Uh, okay. That is definitely a keyhole and half a missing gear. Okay, cool. This is something. Smells like burnt straw. Uh-huh. Cool. So we're going to be burning some straw. Which will light up, I'm guessing, this dark corner here. We're going to burn something which will burn along this pathway and light up this dark corner area over here. Because I can't really see into that very well, so... I'm assuming that's going to be the case. Okay. Can I take this off? I cannot. Alright. Do we put the handle over here? We do. Uh-huh. Okay, so then we move that there. Okay. Okay, that can hang out down there. Okay. Done! Figured it out. <laughs> I'm not as dumb as I look. We can't tell. We don't actually get to see. That's a trigger mechanism. Are we building a gun? Okay. Cool. So these three spots with the X over them have X's over them. Huh. Can I use this here? I'm guessing not because it doesn't look kind of solid. Right? Like usually if they're like, yes, that could fit here, it kind of looks a little solid. It turns into a semi-solid. Hmm. Okay. So this is one of those where it's delightful because I have an almost completely full inventory. And no idea what to do with any of it. Okay. Cool. You're sure there's nothing I can do over here, huh? Maybe I can grab the torches and look around? Absolutely not. The torches have been welded to the wall. Why would you want to look at those? Ooh, maybe, 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 maybe. Ooh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Maybe we put the medallion in here? take a look at it. A small token with a handle on the end. There is nothing I can do with it. A trigger mechanism. Is there anything I can do with this? 
No, because it looks like it's just the stock to a gun and that we are missing the rest of the gun. Okay, what about put the trigger mechanism up here? It seems like something could slot in here. Yeah, I know, I tried. Maybe the metal bar? No. Uh, medallion? No. No. Not at all. Uh, tower? No. No. Okay, ooh, ooh, ooh. there's something on this side. On this side. Metal bar. Ah! A handle that I can then turn. A length of string. Okay. Do we put said length of string in here? No. No, absolutely not. No. Do we put it in here? No. No, no, no. Why would that ever be the case? That makes absolutely zero sense. Um. Okay. And you're sure I can't go look at this very obvious picture? Do we put the trigger mechanism on there? We do. Okay. Cool. Um, oh, it's a crossbow. Ah. Okay. So the string then would also be for the crossbow. I can't tie this on yet. So, okay, so the string is definitely for the crossbow. But I can't tie it on yet. Okay. Ah! The metal piece was to extend the crossbow arms. Now I can tie this on? Now I can tie this on. Okay. We have crossbow bolts! Oh boy. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Couldn't get right into the right angle again. Uh -uh. We're locked and loaded? Yes? Hang on, hang on. Can we go the other direction? We can. Can we go up? We can. No, I don't want to shoot yet. I want to aim. Now fire. Okay, we pierced the eye. Now what? Okay, a broken mirror, a tabletop game, and a winch? This is definitely a broken mi mirror. Why is this part shinier than- I guess that might- No, that's the only part that doesn't have a mirror on it. Why is this part shinier and more reflective than everything else? Huh. Graphical error, maybe? Okay. Hello? See and once mighty people brought low by these heathen intruders. Invaders? Invaders, I guess. And their plunges. Plunges? Plagues. Oh, and their plagues. They look to their priestess for the will of the gods, but their jaguar and the 
feathered serpent. Okay. Speaks to me horrors. Okay. Or honors. Honors, I guess. Honors. Okay. So it's definitely Mesoamerican because the feathered serpent is, I think, a Mayan god. If Nancy Drew can be believed. So it's definitely Mesoamerican of some form. Oh, speak to me no more. Oh, got it. Okay. The crystal of our ancient mother is being summoned. I would speak to them. And there are quite a lot of symbols. These are all symbols we've seen, right? This box we've seen. Um, the Triforce we've seen. Yes, it looks like a Triforce to me. It's an upside down Triforce, but it looks like a Triforce. Um, I don't think we've seen the wall, but like the star shape, we've definitely seen that. I don't think I've seen the box and the triangle. But a lot of these are things we've definitely seen already. So there's that. Fun. Ooh, a maze box. Can I move the coin along the maze box? No, there's a piece missing. Is this the piece? It is! Cool. Can I move it now? Is it this thing that I'm moving? Okay, so it's this thing that I'm moving. Uh-huh. Okay, I see what we're doing here. Yeah, okay, that's what I figured. Okay, so what we're doing is we're trying to get our piece from this end to this end without getting the skull. Okay. I need him this way one more. No matter what I do, I'm stuck. Okay. <laughs> I will figure this out. Nope. Uh, if I go this way, he comes down here. But if I go there, then he comes down there. If I go here, then I'm stuck. If I go up there, then he gets me. So this is a bad move, no matter what. Okay. Okay, because, like, my plan was to get him up here and over there, but maybe what I should do... Give me one second here. Maybe what I should do is I should go... I should bring him along the bottom and then try to go up top. But give me one second. I'll be right back. I have to give my uh, brownies another five minutes. So, oi! All right. So, let's figure this out. So I was trying to lure him up here and then I could go down in the round, but maybe we want to. lure him down this way and then I can go up not quite almost almost I think I am on to something there though oh 
Oh my gosh. Down. Thank you. No. I'm stuck again. Okay. So almost though. do that, he gonna come get me. If I go here, he goes there. If I go back, he goes this way. So he's just gonna chase me. No matter what I do. Hmm. I'm done for again. Okay. Nope. Done for again. Okay. <laughs> I got close once. Yeah, but see, then we run into the same problem as before. If I go down here, he comes down to this crossroads, he's got me. I go over here, he comes down, he's got me. No matter what happens, I'm gone here. Huh. Okay. What if we start going down? But then he follows me up. And then no matter what I do, I'm gone. Okay. Hmm. okay. My plan is I want to get him stuck on one of these and then shimmy around him. No, I went the wrong way. I wanted to go over. Uh. All right. Down this way. No. Uh. Oh, that piece moves. Oh, that's an interesting thought. Okay, so then we get him over here. Okay. Huh! Huh, I did not notice that. That piece moves. Okay, that's interesting. Give me a sec.
All right, sorry about that. Didn't mean to leave you so long this time. That was it for the morning. Next time I go on break, it'll have a break video with it. Sorry about that. Okay. So, uh, this slide piece moves. Which is interesting to know. Okay. So what if I move that piece here and I go that way? He's gonna go up. No, he did go to the side. So let's put him there. Ah! Ha! Got it! <laughs> All right, and I also have the key to the trunk. Okay, what do we got done here? Something I am probably not ready for yet. Okay, cool. <laughs> Oh, I am inordinately proud of myself for that. Okay, there we go. Let's unlock the trunk and find out what nightmare we are subjected to now. Oh boy. We have a large stone brick. Which I am going to guess goes... Where did I leave that table? Ah, over here somewhere? Yep, that's what I thought. But we're not completely finished with this yet. Okay, and then... Okay, now we're going to do it again. Oh, we're not done yet. But we're getting there. Almost. Come on. Just like, what, another two or three wax? Just one. Ah, the mirror shard. Okay, the shard of glass goes up here. Okay, and now it's reflecting the box. But I can't see what else it's reflecting. No clue. Okay, cool. Good to know. The mirror reflects the box and I have no clue what to do with it from there. Kay is desperately looking for brownies. She's not going to find them. There are strange sockets on the chest. Uh, okay, cool. And do we have anything more we can do with the box? The only other thing I see is this thing, and I'm not quite sure what to do with it. Right? Because these X's are X'd out. I only have a gold tower. I'm not quite sure what you want me to do with it. Mirror is showing me a new box. How do I get... Oh. Was it a new box? I thought it was the same box. Oh, mirror. Oh, mirror. Hmm. Oh, I guess it is showing me a different box. Oh, this is where I would use the tower. 
Huh. Okay. Okay. Let's take a look at the letters. It's got to be something with the symbols here, right? Um. Thing is, I don't know what it could be with the symbols. Like, it's got to be something with the symbols. But I'm not sure what. Maybe it's the doors? Maybe this door goes into this door? I don't know. Let's take a look at what we got up here. We got the funky S we've seen before. Uh, I could brute force it pretty easy, actually, I think. Alright. But I have no idea. Because there's only two. Right? So it's got to be something with these symbols. I'm just not quite sure what. Just try all of them together. Found it! No, I have no idea how I was supposed to come to that answer. But I did find it. Okay, so where are we missing a tower? Right here. Thank you! I got a dagger! Cool. Oh, one of these. How are we supposed to undo these latches? Interesting. Okay. Uh, that door definitely opens. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You're in the wrong place. Can we slide you to be central, please? Yes, and that opens the door, and... Now we have a new door. And now I don't know what you want me to create. There are way too many pieces here. What are we looking at? Uh, there's another door. That's what we were looking at. Okay. So we were in Mesoamerica, and now we're in Arabia? Okay, so then it's those two symbols. It's, um... A couple of weird horseshoes and a funky X. Is what we're looking for after that. I would guess on the mirror again. Thank you, game. Because the mirror is the only place that we saw those symbols. Okay. So I would be looking at horseshoes, funky X. Okay. Horseshoes Funky X brings back this box. Oh, so we're solving two different boxes. And I guess the dagger goes in the top? No, not in the least. Cool. Um... Do we use the dagger to poke at the symbols? No. Not at all. Use dagger on panel? No. Okay. Well, it was worth a shot. Uh, alright. Alright. 
So we're solving two different boxes here. To go back to this one, it is Funky X, and the other one was O and N, I think? No. Okay, so the other one was T and V's. Alright, so T and V's to go to this one. Horseshoe and X to go to the other one. Uh, that's where we got the dagger. I was like, oh look, it's a perfect hole! We can fit the dagger right in there! That's where we got it from. Okay. Anything special about this? Hello? Hello? No, I mean there's definitely something weird going on with like these pieces. But it doesn't tell me what, right? Because there's like, there's something weird going on here. And there's something weird with those pieces that's just not in here. But I don't see what. Maybe it's something underneath that I have to unlock. Hmm. Uh, okay. I don't see anything odd there. What about at the top? Oh, okay. Anything with any of those? No. There's definitely something unique up here because it lets me click on this. I mean, maybe that's for the pillars. That's possible because we did put the other pillar up there, so maybe that's for the pillars. Okay. Fair enough. And the fact that it gave me the horseshoes and X symbols makes me think that we should be going back to the other box. Alright, so... T and V's or horseshoe and X is what we're working with. T and V or horseshoe and X. So the fact that it gave me this tells me we should probably be looking for something on this box, but I'm not sure what. I mean, there's definitely something up here. Dagger does go in the top of that box. See? I'm not crazy. Well, I am. But I'm not. But I am. Oh! Did we just kill this little doll person? It does kind of look like we just did kill that doll person. But, um... There was that one area over here, right? Where they were like, it smells like burning straw. So the little doll person goes there. And then we have to go up here. We have to go N. What is it? Uh, it's horseshoe and X or... V is the other side, so... I know that. What was the other one? Where are the V's on this one? Here we go. T and V. It's T and V or horseshoe and X. Alright. So now that we have the gem, thank you, let's spin around here to this side. We are missing a gem here. Now we've got it. I have no idea what we're doing with it, but we've got it. Okay. 
Okay. Is it one of these where you just kind of have to guess the pattern? I'm going to say it's one of these where you just kind of have to guess the pattern. Because there are a couple of those. No. Because we've been through all of them now. Now I'm just going through all of them again. Just to be sure I'm not crazy. Yeah, okay, no, so we've been through all of them. Okay. So I have to know which ones to turn on. All right. So it's not a guess a pattern, it's a combination lock. Because you can turn on two, but when you get to three, it shuts off. So three of these should be lit up. So it's a combination lock. Oh. 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 Okay. 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 Hang on, 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 hang on. I think I know where to find the combination for the combination lock. T and V. Horseshoe and X. Okay. Yes, yes, I know, I know. It's it's rather mysterious and shocking. Okay, um, over here on this one side that I could not figure out for the life of me. All right, so it's top corner and then the two on the bottom corner. Okay, cool. I could do that. All right, we could figure that out. All right, so let's go T and V. Thank you. All right, so it's top corner and then the two around the diagonal corner. That's what we're looking for. Thank you, can we spin? Can we spin again? Okay, so it's these two and that one. <laughs> A piece of flint, okay, so that's what we need to set the doll on fire. I see, past lives, future lives, impossible lives. Okay, cool, dude. Alrighty. Uh, down here in the corner. Uh, we can slot some flint in there. Um. Well, it's sparking, but it ain't setting it ablaze here. Huh. There we go. Got it. And are we exploding something? I was figuring we were just lighting something up. Yep. Oh, good. More light. Light is awesome. Okay, so there's that guy. And I figured it was something to do with this thing. Okay. I got it. I know what we're doing. Alright, I know what we're doing. This is crossbow again. Let's put in another bolt. Okay. Load her up. Okay, and then we are going to want to go over here. Thank you. Line that up there and fire! <laughs> I am not entirely an idiot. Eh, just mostly. Alright, what do we got over here? Uh, a metal object with a star-shaped 
at either end. like it's meant to break something. Okay. I am blind as my reflection. Our gods do not live here. This way brings no salvation. This path is not for my people. I shall seal them from it. Oh, okay. Cool. So flipping this switch breaks this thing. Whatever it is. So that's meant to hold something that needs to be broken somehow. Okay, cool. Um, it's like letting me press buttons randomly down here. That's weird. Okay. Uh, what is this piece for? Oh, 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 oh. Oh! 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 No, I did not just step on a Lego. I know what it's for. Here, we're gonna put this in the box and then close the box. Ah! And now we have a table? A metal shard with a ridged hole in its center. Okay. Cool. Now we have a table. We have a chest with a table. Okay, cool. Cool. See? See? Figured things out. So then, do we put you up here? No. No. No, we do not do that. Um... Do we stick it in that guy's eye? No, because we can't look at that guy. I can't reach the mechanism, so I'm pretty sure what we were meant to do with the mechanism was just shoot the sandbag, which would activate the mechanism. Uh, okay. So... Piece of metal I picked up looks like it fits something. Well, yeah. I knew that much. Okay, so we know what we were doing with all that stuff. I figured out all that stuff. Um, the only thing I could think of is look at the other box, right? Figured out the crossbow thing. Yeah, the only thing I could think of is look at the other box. See if it's something on the other box. So... Horseshoes... And... X. Horseshoe and X or TNB. So let's look at Horseshoe and X. on top of here? No. Okay. Hmm. Well, yeah, I know we've seen, well, I don't know if we've seen something with the same shape. But I'm sure we have. I just don't know what you want from me here, game. The only thing I could think of is this thing up here. It's the only thing we haven't used yet. It wouldn't even let me do anything with it. Yeah, 
Yeah, it wouldn't even let me do it. It's definitely to break something, but I don't think it's this piece. Kay is going to bark, and I am sorry about that. She spotted the mailman, and she is very excited. Um, it's on the other box. It's on the other box, isn't it? Um, T and V, please. Yep, I know. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. Sounds very Egyptian for being in a Mayan tomb with a, um, this thing? No? Looks like it's this thing. That's because it is this thing. Okay, cool. Uh, what? Oh, that's freaky looking. Okay, so I'm guessing the idea is to get all of these to be the same variant of size, right? So that all of the white pieces. Huh. See, that's interesting, though. There we go. Got it. It's gonna be like, because this piece can only go on either that one or that one. There we go. Got it! Oh! Hi! That's not creepy at all. C cool. Are we gonna put that on top of the, the thing and the skull? Oh, are we gonna break this thing open? Is that, is that the plan? Is the plan to put the skull up here and then break it? That is absolutely the plan. The plan is to put it up here and break it. Look away! Ugh. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yep. Oh, was that it? Was that it? That was short. Okay, cool. Where are we going with this game? Okay. <laughs> Uh, apologies. K9 has spotted something to bark at. It is the mailman, and she is not happy. Okay. Ah! Here we go. This is where we should be aiming for, I think. we're getting there here. Right? Because I can kind of see the box taking shape here. Okay, hang on guys. I might have to mute up and pause for a second. Sorry, Kay got really upset because the mailman got all confused and didn't know which house he was going to, and it wasn't ours. But he got all mixed up, which got her all excited. Okay. So I feel like I can almost see it taking shape here, right?
but that and also it keeps glitching at me when I'm over here. Okay. Oh, good. Here's the box I'm supposed to be making down here in the corner. Okay. So that's helpful. Yeah, right here is where it looks like we start making box type progress. But it's upside down. Maybe if we go this way? Okay, there we go. There we go. Now we're getting box type progress. Found it! I just had it backwards. That was actually a really, really quick one. I've done that one yesterday. That was really fast. Barely even an hour on that one. Alright, cool. So, you handled yourself well in the temple. May your good fortune be a light as you navigate the ever darker chambers. Cool. What are we doing next? Okay. Looking at the snow outside, wasn't paying attention. We're in a 1920s lounge? Definitely the 1900s, I can tell you that. Button must be missing something, it doesn't work. Hello. <clears throat> a Bailey and Sons, a Miss Margaret Cox. I am writing you for the final time. Before I begin the proceedings, I have brought to your attention. Since my brother's disappearance, you have attached yourself to my mother like a leech. For her sake, I prefer this to be quiet. But you are a charlatan and a fraud. I will expose you as much if I must. Leave her be, or else the paper has offered me a full page. Robert Bailey. A viewfinder? Could I look through it? Also, I forgot we should be looking through the room. Because sometimes they just like... That's weird. That looks like there's a hand like holding up a mask or something. There is also a page on the floor. What is this? My regular note from AS down here? <clears throat> For Mr. Simon, Simon Grayson, a.k.a. The Great Khan. What has become of you? You know that I can tell when you're lying. I was the one you could never fool. I know you have it. You've started playing without me. Have you started playing without me? It sounds magnificent. This pressman isn't going to leave me alone, and you owe me so. Since when can you resist putting on a performance? We'll be pioneers. I'll be at the line at nine o'clock. You'll be there. I know you. Mags. Okay, cool. This looks like it's a thing on the bottom here. Um. Hi. Oh, that just opens. We found a piece of a photograph and... <clears throat> If you were here, then my trials have not been in vain. If nothing else, my promise to you 
gave me purpose. If I was damned for trapping you here, then now I offer you my redemption. I finally hold the key. The secret to this world of worlds, this place of endless places. Without it, you may lift, or with it, you may lift the veil and peek behind the curtain. Do we not have to take the path that is offered? We do not have to take the path that is offered. I have a key. Hmm. Cool, can I has it? I can has key? Uh, okay, cool. Uh, yes. Turn on the light. Found the key! In case you were wondering, I found the key that he was referring to. Hey, can I read this article up here? There, there's a framed news article. I'd like to read that. Ooh. I bet you. Come here, come here, come here. We have a key. I bet you this is the key. Am I wrong? Ooh, I am not right, but I am also not wrong. Uh, okay. Cabinet has a strange shape lock. Okay. So we have the torn photograph that goes in there, but we don't have the key for it. Cool. What about all this fun drawer down here? No, that's not a drawer. Those are definitely supposed to be, well, I was going to say hinges, but I think these are actually the hinges. So this is some kind of decoration that's on one side, but not the other. Uh, well, I have a viewfinder piece. Does that go with the camera? Does that go with the camera? No? Okay. Nothing to say about the weird old camera in the middle of the room. Cool. Temple, voyage, time, null. Oh, we're missing some cards, huh? Science, home, death, stairs, and null. Well, null shouldn't have a card. Unless it does. Okay. I don't know. I don't do the whole tarot card thing. Um, Viewfinder. Go here. I was not holding on that one. Okay. Definitely unlocking the roll top at one point. It would really help if we could see, you know, the rest of the room. That would be great. But, you know, who needs to actually see when you're solving an escape room? Vision's overrated. Okay. What do you think? Well, yeah, I was thinking it was part of the camera, but you wouldn't let me stick it on there. Can I zoom in further on the camera? Uh, knob. I can't see anything. Like, I am not kidding. I cannot see a thing. Well, I'm trying to investigate, but you're not letting me. It's missing a viewfinder. Okay, found the part for the camera. Alright, we found a metal handle. Can 
Can I pull this up? No, absolutely not. Okay. No. Okay. That's a really modern looking piece for this to be. Oh, we're missing a flash bulb. We need a flash bulb. Okay. Um Anywhere that looked like it could use a handle of some sort? Yeah, a small metal handle. Anywhere you can think of that looked like it needed a handle. Um, curio cabinet? No. Okay. There's only like four places I can look. No. No. Okay. It's definitely not on the table. Which leaves somewhere on the camera, which is kind of annoying. Because the camera is in the most darkness in this room. And that is frustrating as all get out because I can't see a ding dang thing over here. Uh, all right. What do you say? Yeah, I figured that much. But again, I can't see a ding dang thing over here. Maybe on this thing? It looks like a gear. Okay. Wind that out. And now can we look through here? No, it's too dark. Cool. Anything else I can do over here? No, just pull the camera out. I don't... Oh. Again, I can't see anything in the camera. Nope, the camera's as pulled out as we're gonna get it. Which is great! But I can't see it. Okay, let's try the lens maybe. Well, it makes everything slightly more visible. But only slightly. And I'm pretty sure that's not what it's meant to do. I tried! You wouldn't let me! I was like, maybe I can look through it now. I'm trying. You're not letting me. We, what? You want me to look through it backwards? It's not letting me look through the camera. I don't know what more you want from me. You want me to spin the focus? What do you want? It, I can't even see it! You won't even let me look! It won't let me look through the camera. I don't know what they want here. They're like, look through the camera, and I'm like, okay, I'll look through the camera. What, what do you want from me? There we go. Ah, okay. There we go. I was expecting to have to, like, put my eye up to it. Oh, good! Earthquake! That's how you open the roll top, huh? That is a weird way to open your roll top desk, I'm just saying. 
That is a strange way to have to open your desk. key is the wrong shape. Okay, so the end of the key is the wrong shape for the lock, but it is one of those keys that is mobile. So maybe it goes up this way. So it should have a little divot there. Yes. Yes. Ha! Fun! Well, I did say I like these. But I would love to know what I'm doing with it. And we're not done with that key. It put it back in my inventory. Interesting. Uh, can I look in the drawers over here? I can, but I'd have to reshape the key. Okay. Um. So this is everything down for this one? It is. Okay. And this is definitely a, like, pull the drawers to the right number thing, right? I don't know, because we've got numbers over here. We've got two, three, four, and five. So this is definitely, like, a combination thing. Like, pull the drawers to the right combination. And I don't know the combination! Hmm. another keyhole? It is. Okay. So we need long side, short side, thing in the middle. Alright. It's this one in the middle. Uh, short side. No. Short side. Oi. Alright. Long side. Up here. Short side. Out this way. Medium side in the middle. Oh, ooh, ooh, that's not, that's not, yeah, I know. I see it, I see it, I see it. Now it will work. Okay. Who designed this desk? Why is your desk a puzzle box? I don't, you're saying you. Okay. So we're definitely aiming for getting this piece out. Have we made a slidey puzzle? Ooh, we love these. We have made a slidey puzzle. It would be better if I could actually see what's going on up here. This corner is completely black. Done! Okay, so then that goes here. Thank you. We have a long metal lever? Okay. Um. Ah! Scales. We need two levers and we need something to weigh here. No? Uh, okay. Cool. Nifty. 
You have yet to tell me how we are using the picture over there, game. I do not understand you. Is this a thingy? This is not a thingy. Okay. Oh! Oh, it's a typewriter! Oh! Okay. What do I typewriters? That is the funkiest looking typewriter I have ever seen. Oh, buddy. Oh, that is extremely inefficient. That wasn't the original typewriter, was it? I mean, it's possible, but... Oh, that is extremely inefficient. Oh, buddy. Okay. So, I've run all these notes. Is there any of them that, like, had a clue in them for, hey, you should be writing this? Uh, no? There's a V on this desk. Oh, what's this? Ah, uh, yeah, we've already solved that. Never mind, never mind. I thought it was something to write. Nope. Oh, infinity. So I N F I N I T Y. I am never going to spell that right, but I super appreciate the vote of confidence. I N F I N I think I missed an I. Why? All right. Um. Hey, can you let me? Can you let me see your spelling? Okay. Yeah. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now I can kind of see your spelling because I cannot spell. Where's a hill of beans? F I N I T Y Yes Okay, we got it. We began at home, starting, staring at the stars. So much to discover. So much, so little time. Okay. So, began at home, staring at the sky. So much to discover, so little time. Delightful. Is there anything else I'm missing? There is not. Okay. That is definitely the back of a chair. I thought that was a person sitting there with their hands pyramided. Their hands kind of triangled in the center there. It's weird. Is this thing new? It is not. Uh, okay. So we figured out how to use the typewriters. The 
again at home staring at the stars. I don't think that's a coded message. Like, I was thinking about it for a second, and I was like, ooh, is that a coded message? Like, maybe something to do with where the tarot cards are placed? But I don't think so. What is it? Four on each side? Yeah, four on each side. So that's eight. I would be looking for a code that would be some... That would be three digits between one and five. So, no. I mean, it might be a code for later, but definitely not for now. The only thing I've got is this piece of picture, and I know it belongs in here, but I can't get in there to put it there. Yeah. It's a torn photograph behind the glass. I have to get behind the glass in order to put it up. I know that it goes there. I just can't get there. Yeah, no, I, I get it that they have to mean something. Uh, okay. Let's go with doing this. Two, three. Nope. Oh, okay. Let's pull that out one and go. Okay, let's pull that out one and say doo -doo -doo. Okie dokie. So I'm just trying to brute force this because I know they want me to do the Roman numerals next, but I don't know what they want. You just wanted a stair step? Okay. Thank you. I am very glad you gave me a flash bulb. Now what am I doing? Hey, I finally get to... Oh! Oh! Oh, we get to move these around. Oh. Okay. Are we, like, creating a path? Or... Yeah, but like that doesn't connect. See, like this connects here, that but that one doesn't connect in, so that would be a dead end. That connects there. Do we have a marble somewhere? Ah. Okay. over here. Uh, back one. Let's go up here, down there. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to do this and then down there and boom! Got the drawer. So we got the cosmos. Okay, so yeah, that's staring at the stars. We began at home staring at the stars. Alright, so yeah, like I thought, that is going to be some, si some sort of code, just not the one we were thinking. Can we please put the bulb in here? Will this give us any form of light over here? Please?
Okay. We have a photo. That's not creepy. Hey. Cool. So they began at home staring at the stars. What was the rest of it? They didn't have time. So much to discover, so little time. So do we have anything for discovery? Or time? Time. We have time. We have time. So much to discover, so little time. There we go. We have time. Right? We have light. Well, we rang a bell that I didn't even know was up there. Can I get to see things? Oh, you want me to type another word? V O Y A G E. They want me to do more English. Oh, buddy. <laughs> I am great with words. Oh. Why? A. G. E. Yeah? Countless ships bore us. Triumphant to a hidden temple. It was at home. You provided a shallow friend. Okay. Ships triumph temple? Alright, what do we got? Ship, temple, home, because there's no triumph, so home. Ship, temple, home, what do we get? Yep, that was it. It was ship, temple, home. Oh, I broke the wine glass this time. Oh, good. Yay. Endless. Ooh, that one's not that hard. I can do that. I can do that. That one's not that hard. Okay, cool. That's good. Thanks for giving me an easy one, game. And I know most people are going, aren't they all easy ones? No! Uh, L. S S. Yes. Haha. <laughs> Got it. All right. Under these alien stars, the stars again. I courted only death, so stars death. I am saved by science. My muse. Uh, no other words. I am saved by science, my muse. So, stars, death, science is this one. Okay. I can, I can do that. I can do that. We can do that. That's not that hard. Stars. I don't have death. Ah. Do I have science? I have science. The only thing we don't have is we don't have the death card. Okay. Yeah, thank you. I, I know. I need the death card. 
The only thing I have, though, is that picture. There's got to be a way into the cabinet. There is? Oh, yeah, well, I mean, there's this. But I didn't know what to do with it. Unless there's something else up here. No, that's the that's the thing we've already solved. So there's this thing, but it, like it won't let me interact. I mean, I know about that, but it won't let me interact. Game, what do you got for me? I did. It wouldn't let me. Ugh, all right, fine. Okay, we're I'm guessing we've got a combination lock of some sort here. Because it's not letting me do anything with said levers. So we've got a combination lock of some sort. Do we have any sort of numbers? We have dates, which are numbers in a way, but I don't know if they translate to this. We have down here, which is a V, which could be a five, but I'm not quite sure what that means. Uh, we have this guy's letter, which has nothing. Cool. We have all of these, which is also not a big help. What about the lens? The lens give me anything? Nothing. Not a thing. Cool. Because I would hate for there to be help going on. Yeah. Uh, nope. Nope. I got nothing. What you got for me? Oh, okay. Up, up, down, up, down, down, up. So two up, skip one, one, and then the last one. Okay. So two up, skip one, and then this the last one should be up. Okay. Thank you. Found the card for death. Ah, creepy. No, yeah, yeah. I mean, I knew that was coming. Can you let me move? Because you weren't letting me a second ago. Alright. And then we put that in there. Alright. What other secret words am I to know? Ooh, that little bell's basically flipping upside down. Oh, it fell off. Hope! Oh, they took pity on me. They gave me another easy one. Hope! I can do that. H O P E Watch me misspell it because, of course. The null graced me with time. For a dozen lives. Oh, for a dozen lives work. Now death returns to take his revenge. His due. Okay. But I don't have the null, right? 
Because it did say the null was one of the cards. I don't have it. So it's definitely null, time, and death. is the last ones here. So it's null, where's time? Time and death. It's null is nothingness? No? Okay. I tried! I was like, well null is nothing so maybe there just isn't a card for it. What are the odds the photograph is null? No. Okay. Alright, is there anything else I have not solved in the room? Anything at all? We have the desk completed. I mean, there's the giant box in the center, but I think, I think the camera's completed. It's just this one. And I don't have a handle for it. Pretty sure we've completed the desk. Uh, let's take a look at the box. Yeah, we've got this strange shape on the box as well. The same one for the um, for the car. Is it the bell? You have a bell. Is it this thing? No. Okay. There's a keyhole, but I don't have a key. Let's take a look at the bell. What do we got? Uh, it's a spinny puzzle. Okay, we have the clapper from the bell. No, okay, that's fine. It does say that it's not quite the right shape. Instead of it being, oh, this isn't it. Okay. Now it's the right shape. Okay. 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 I'm with you now. Here we go. Let's go over here. Let's hit this. Let's say, turn the key. Thank you. That does not get me to the other side. That just gets me to the one side. Now the other side is open. No? Now we have a safe. Okay, cool. And we have the dial for said safe. And now we get to do some safe cracking. Yay! Everybody's favorite. Okay. Hope maybe? A T P K E. No. Um. D E A T. No, it's not death either. I don't know. We need a four letter word. Uh, okay. Thank you. Can we move the book further up? Can we move the book further up? I'm trying, alright? It not letting me. There it goes. Alright, so that goes to the center of the decorative plate that was just a giant hole. 
because this is definitely how you fix the decorative plate. Just so you know. That is definitely how we fix the plate. I was aiming for the cent- oh no, okay, so the centerpiece is- that's what we want to aim for. Okay, cool. K-H-A-N. Khan. It's that one dude's name. Okay. So... K... Um, no, 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 no. So, K... H... A... N? I think that's how you spell it. Ah, oh, I had it. Alright. Let's try it again. One more time. K. H. A. N. Yes. Okay, and that gives me the null card. Cool. And then we can put the null card in there, and there we go. Null time and death. Oh! The picture fell off the wall. Everything's flying everywhere. Okay, not how I wanted to get behind the glass, but, um, effective. Alright, show me what's creepy about this one. Yep, okay. Ah, the skeleton is suddenly there! Hey, buddy. Um, pardon me. <clears throat> now you see the truth of it! Time within this place works differently from without. An hour, a day, a century? Who is to say? A pity. I had to wait here to see you on your final step of the journey. Everything is in readiness. Take this. Use it to find the room. Cool. I'm trying to take it. It will not let me. Uh, okay. It would help if I could see something. Anything at all. Anything at all. Ah. An infinite key. Okay. Cool. Is there anything else that we're supposed to see in there? Can I play with anything in there? Nope. Not at all. Uh, goes into the fancy box. The key goes into fancy box, just so y'all know. Uh, yeah. Oh, good. We're going to get dumped in a robo. From an attic to a rowboat. You ought to be congratulated. Escape the curious events of the sails with all of your faculties intact. I did! More or less. Everything I had when I started, I guess. It's not saying much. <laughs> uh, 
Okay. Hey game. Hey game. You know what would be great? You didn't have this in the last one. Oh, I saw it. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I saw it. Screen brightness. Can we talk about being, I don't know, just, just a little brighter? <gasps> oh my gosh, I can see! More or less. Oh, I love being able to see things. Oh, it makes my life so much easier when I can actually see what's going on in front of me. Okay, are we supposed to be winding ourselves in to the boat? I assume. Well, I mean, at least let me... Ah! Ooh, creepy thing. Hi. Cool, creepy thing that's totally not going to attack the boat when I pull in. Oh, I'm gonna row in and not see the Kraken. And he's not going to attack my boat. Hey there. Hey guys, you know there's a kraken living out in your ocean? Even short journeys can cover a great distance. By making it to the other side of the crossing, you are now ready for the final step. May good fortune be go with you. Probably not. I'm not known for good fortune. Oh boy. We're probably in the tower to the one house where we started, right? I see a book. Can I read the book? No. I see a desk. Is there a note on the desk? No, but the null is floating around inside this a delightful little spear, which I assume we're going to have to unlock. Uh. Cool. Alright. Let's look around. Kind of get a feel for the place. See if there's anything sticking out anywhere. Um, that looks like a ball of wiggly intestines. Uh, there's a book up here. Can I open a book? No. A recess with electrical electrical connections. Oh, are we gonna electrify something? That'll be. Cool. We have to complete the circuit and electrify things. Uh Okay, so game, you remember when we talked about, you know, actually being able to see things? You remember that little chat? You remember that chat we had there, game? You know, actually being able to see things. 
Subject Alpha 17, Lampara Atara. Subject unresponsive to post-mortem app of serum number four. Combo with electrical stimulation, range of 10 to 100 milliamps. Corpse degradation considerable with high apres. Conclude collaboration unsuitable for further study. So, he was trying to use Null to bring back the dead. Ugh, don't do that. Don't do that. I know it hurts when we lose people we love, but don't try to bring them back. Just don't. It never ends well. When do people learn that trying to cheat death never ends well? Oh, okay, there is something back here. It looks like a Bunsen burner of sorts. Yeah, but it's just the lens that I'm allowed to click on. Okay, cool. Don't, don't try to like, oh, I will master death. Don't, don't do that. Hi. I have a screwdriver. Subject beta four, ratatus, ratatus, so a rat. Subject necrosis significantly halted by pre-mortem app of serum number five. Temporary musculature reflex restoration witnessed with post-mortem electrical stimulation of a range 75 to 85 milliamps. So he managed to stop the corpse, uh, the rat corpse from degrading. Actually, no, it restored it. So, reflex restoration. So, it started uh, twitching. Delightful. Part of the plaque is missing. Yeah, I'd say. That's a star shaped indentation. There's another number one up here. What is this about? And there's a gem down here. Oh, there's also one up here. Okay, cool. Fine. Fair enough. I feel like these things, right, we should be able to turn them? No? And you're sure I'm not allowed to look at the book, huh? Okay. I'm not allowed to look at the book, guys. They're sure about that. Um, do we have anything to unscrew? I think I saw a couple of screws over here. Like big obvious ones, not like these. These are rivets. I was looking for screws. There's one right there. Okay, cool. We got a wooden box. Um, do I do not have a code for this. Could go and brute force it like I've done in the past. Okay. I don't know. It's probably better to find the code. I would love to get the code. But I don't see anywhere to start acquiring such a magnif- Is that a metal door wired with electricity? Are we going to wire the door? I feel like he wants us to wire the door. 
And I feel like that's probably like legitimately the worst idea ever. Okay. So this lets me see the one desk, but upside down? Why? No, okay. What are we doing here? Not a clue. Cool. Who needs a clue? Uh, no. Well, I was hoping it looked about the same. Uh, okay, you've got a nice beetle in there. That's awesome, my dude. Okay, cool. Uh, no, I cannot go over to that desk, so it's just this one here, really. Um... I don't see anything obvious for unscrewing over here. Can we stick this guy in it? No. No, absolutely not. I'm pretty sure that's something I'm supposed to solve. Okay... Uh, we have another machine. <gasps> I see something under a panel. A panel that has bolts, not screws. Okay. Um. Oh, that's interesting. Ooh! Oh! Oh, that gives me numbers. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. I actually don't have to back out of it to see what number, what uh, patterns we need. All right. So we need uh, sideways waves, eight, and weird stick figures. Okay. So we need waves. That's one. Eight is seven, and stick figures is three. Okay, so it's one, eight, three. So it's one. I'd have gotten there eventually. Did I do that right? One, eight, three? That is one, right? I'm not crazy. That looks like a one to me. Oh, one, seven, three. Uh, oh, 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 oh. I'm just crazy. It's fine. We found a battery. Well, uh, what do you say we go put the battery in the box with all the electricity? Yes. And turn it on. I said turn it. Oh my gosh. <gasps> okay. Nope. I'm fine with this. This is good. See, I get there and then it's slides itself up. The controls just are not working. Mm. 
Okay, so it's not staying for reasons. I'm not crazy. Oh wait, so there are a couple of places I could use a battery. Oh, fun. What about also... There is a battery alcove over here. Hello? Um... Let's try and get the machine running. Flip the switch. Okay. Oh, it wasn't charged! Oh! Oh, we needed to charge the battery first! Oh! Oh, okay. Cool. Alright, that makes more-ish sense than anything else. Alright. Um... Now what? Uh... Now what? Uh... Okay... I have a thing working. Now what do I do with it? Okay. Now what do we do with this? Um... Okay. Ah, ah. Okay. We focus the laser. Yay, I have a star-shaped handle. I know I saw a place for a star-shaped handle earlier. Uh, okay, can we talk about this thing? Uh, absolutely unequivocally no. I am not allowed to do that. Okay, cool. I saw a place earlier where they were like, it's a star-shaped handle. Now, if only I could remember where that was. Um. Okay. Where did I see a need for a star shaped? Well, it's definitely not here, right? Huh. Okay. I think we're done with this. I think the whole point of this was to charge the battery. And we're good now. That one we're done with, right? Ooh, 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 ooh. No! Okay, I thought that was the star-shaped handle. Nope. Nope. That one we are also done with. Cool. Where's the desk with all the numbers? You! Ha! Ah! Ah! Cool! One, two, okay. I have no idea what we did, but we did something. Okay. I didn't hit the switch on the side of one. So one is still stuck, so I'm assuming I can go back to that. I have the wheel. <coughs> Adieu, Professor de Mont. De Mont Function. 
Bunction? Bunction? Demont. We're calling him Demont. Dear Professor Demont, well, uh, doubt. Well, I don't doubt your authentic motive. Your sister's condition is not aided by her continued confinement to your estate. I beg of you to see Madame Lucy return to the sanatorium as early as can be arranged. Yours, Dr. Beckett. So his sister went loopy and he's trying to fix it. Cool. Switch it to one, because I messed that up. Okay, and then there should be a switch on the side. There we go. It's on the other side. That's why I didn't see it. Okay. Oh, <sighs> sometimes these controls. Okay. Sometimes the controls don't work with me. Sometimes they actively work against me. Because I should be able to just open this door and let it hang open, but it won't let me do that. Oh my gracious, I started hearing people yelling and for a second there I thought it was something in the game. Nope, just kids outside playing in the snow. <sighs> just open the cabinet. Thank you! Ugh. And yes, I'm supposed to be all, ew, bugs! But that's, that's not what I'm thinking. X5, exception 5Z, subject EH, upper right appendage severed at Glen, at Glen Humeral joint. Necrosis in subject halted completely via pre-mort app of serum number 5, followed by post-mort app of serum number 4. Perfect musculature, reflexes witnessed with el Electric stim at 77 and 3 fourths MA. Okay. Cool, we found a very large handle. And he got a thing for bugs. That's definitely like a mirror of some sort, right? in the bug there. That's not a real bug. That's some kind of mirror in there. It's slightly reflective. There is a missing beetle, if the labor is correct. Yeah, yeah, they're, um, the stag beetle's over at the one place. We just haven't figured out how to get it out of there. Okay. Um, we were missing a reel of film over here. I think we just found it. Yes. Uh, that does not look like a place for a handle. A recess in, with electrical connections inside. Okay, so... Then it's for the battery, but the battery's stuck in here. I can't get the battery out of here. So is there a second battery? That I must find and charge? I mean, there has to be, right? Gotta be a second battery somewhere around here to charge. In 
here, maybe? Actually, yeah, there is a battery in there, right there. Look at that. Okay. Um, are we done over here? No, not super. Huh. Well, I mean, yeah, I know the crank handle is useful for something. Okay, there is a child with a dog that just went running past. Never mind. All right, um... Sorry, I saw the dog go running past and was like, uh, I see dog. Do I see person with dog? Or has dog escaped again? Yeah, okay, what? Crank candle seems quite sturdy. It's clearly designed to move something big. Delightful. Do we have any idea what? Well, I mean, they're saying something big. That's definitely an electrical coil. Not a place for a crank. I don't know what you're seeing that I'm not game. To be fair, it's your thing, so of course you're seeing something that I'm not. Can we talk about your cable management, sir? You must be tripping up all over your lab. Tape them to the floor or something. You're gonna break your neck in here one of these days. Although to be fair, if it's the person, if it's the lab that I think it is, then it's the one guy who discovered Null and had us going down this rabbit hole in the first place. Uh, all right, what do you got? The shape of the crate matches the socket on the side of the round table. There's a socket on the side of the round table. Oh, I guess there is. Yeah. Okay. Fine. You win. I didn't even see that. Okay. Um. Cool. It spins the table. That's nifty. Huh. Okay, so what I find interesting is that it seems like no matter where I spin it, the laser still connects to the same hole, which is strange, right? That's, that's weird. Unless the table's staying in place and what we're spinning around is we're spinning this whole thing? I don't know. It's, it's strange either way. No, that's not a thing. That looks like it's a thing. No, it is not a thing. It is a little rivet area with a... No. Alright, what? Turning the table gives the upper handle around the group. Yeah, I know! I saw that! Yeah, I'm not that dumb. I mean, I'm not that smart either, but I'm not quite that dumb. So then, like, maybe right there, because that's the same shape as the handle itself. There's a hole in the top of the table where I should be able to rotate the other. Yeah, I, I see that. Yeah. Yeah, no, we got it. We got it lined up. I don't know what else you want me to do from there. Can I pull the handle? I can pull the handle from there. Okay. Uh, 
now what? Yeah, okay. It's definitely meant to hold a mirror, right? Or at least I'm like 80% positive it's meant to hold a mirror. Yeah, it's meant to hold a mirror so that we can then like... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Go back, go back, go back. There we go. Okay. Can we talk about where you're going? In a circle. Cool. And this one goes to that mirror, which is now active. Okay, cool. All right. Um. There we go. I was going to say, it's got to be this bug. It's got to be that bug, because that bug we established was definitely a mirror. Okay, and that should allow us to get to the new battery. Oh, I'm fine. I can open a cabinet. I can. I can open a cabinet. See, I get it all the way out of here. That's as far as it lets me go. And it's like, oh yeah, you didn't want to really open it. That's the frustrating part of this. Is there like click and drag. And I click and drag. And it's like, oh, okay, you wanted it there and to stop. <sighs> can we go further? If I shift the screen so that my body is not blocking, can I go further? Please? Come on. I just want you to open the cabinet. That's all I want. I wasn't asking for much. I was just asking to... This is where the, the controls get just a little bit frustrating. Is when they do stuff like this. And it's like, all I wanted was to just open the cabinet. That's all I was aiming for. Can that be open? Thank you. All right. What do we got down here? Uh, medicinal tonic. I mean, this thing, obviously. Experiment 13, subject L. Cardiac viscous. Necrosis halted indefinitely. Manual operation at 77 and, and three quarters milliamp. Facsimile of life restored only with proximity to raw null. Oh my gosh, there's a gnat in here. It's going to drive me crazy. Missed. I missed, and it's going to fly around my eyes for another 30 minutes, and it's going to drive me insane. All right. Uh, no further avenues. No way back. Dear Lucy, forgive me. I was too late. So he was trying to save his sister, but he didn't quite make it. Alright. Ooh, we have a beetle. Um, this is not the beetle that it said it was missing, right? It said it was missing uh, a different kind of beetle. Yeah, it said it was missing a stag beetle, the rhino beetle. Um, is one of them a rhino beetle? Yes, one of them is a rhino beetle. Okay. Let's go. It is this table over here. Let's put the battery in. And charge it up! Oh, this is the easiest part. 
part of this game right now. Ah. Okay, now we gotta get this guy out. Because we blew a fuse. Burnt out fuse. I'll discard it. We're gonna need a new fuse then before we can fix the battery. That being the case. Where could I find a new fuse in here? I'm more than willing to cannibalize if I don't need the machinery anymore. Uh, interesting. It's no longer pulsating. I just noticed that. Huh. Okay. Is this glowing because there's a thing? I doubt it. No. Okay. It just always looks like that. I'm just crazy. That is more than fine. I expect to be crazy. I need a new fuse. There's got to have been some place where he put it. Obviously. Yep. Do any of the jars on the bottom shelf of the cabinet hold anything useful? Okay. I already looked at them. They didn't see anything. Okay, so it's turned the jar of medicinal tonic and there's a fuse in there. A piece of broken plaque. Okay. So then it's go to one, put the plaque back in place. And there's the fuse. Okay. Sure. I believe that. Now let's go back over to here. Put the fuse back in. Everything's ready to go. Let's do this again, please. Flip the switch. No, we have to start from the beginning. Okay. Now flip the switch. Now flip the switch. Oh my gosh, and now the switch won't flip. Switch to flip. Switch to flip. Oh my gracious. Flip the switch. Ugh. Please. Please, game. Please, game. All I wanted to do was just flip the switch. Please, game. Seriously, this is this is what they do. <sighs> Come on. Turning the wheel was easy. Why won't you thank you? Let me flip the switch. Okay. Found a battery. Now. Now that we have a fully charged battery. There is a zoetrope over here that needs a battery. I don't think it's a zoetrope. Yeah, it kind of is. Ooh. Oh, that's delightful. Oh. Oh, fun. Oh. Oh, joy. Okay. Cool. We're, we're gonna have to go bring the creepy arm back to life, aren't we? No? It's not bring the creepy arm back to life? Well then what was it? Maybe we look through it with the lens on. What do we get? Twenty? No, VV zero. Okay, so it's the it's the V's and the zeros. Okay. 
And now we have another mirror and a beetle. That's definitely a mirror. No, no, it's not a mirror. It's, um, it's a picture. It was a zoetrope type thing. Okay, cool. All right. Um, beetle? Cool, I am officially out of items to do anything with. All right, uh, nifty. Um, I don't think it's moved the table again, right? But I, I was like, maybe if we move the laser over to the lock, maybe the lock will release. But I don't think it's moved the table again. Um, okay. So it ends here on the bug. Can I move the bug? No. Is the bug wrong? No, the bug's not wrong. The bug's correct. That's correct. So then, like, why is it dead ending at the bug? I don't understand that. Do we need to clean the mirror? I'll clean the mirror! I can polish that up real fast. It's fine. Just use my sleeve or something. It's not that big a deal. Alright, what do you want from me, game? Looking through the eyepiece, there's a strange marking on the drawer in the cabinet. There is? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm assuming you're talking this cabinet. There's a strange marking on the drawer in the cabinet. Uh, no? Okay. Are we talking about this? Uh, which cabinet? I mean, I would assume this cabinet. Is it this drawer? Because it's not letting me go down there. Yeah, there is. Okay. So it says down, whatever that's worth. But it won't let me do anything about it. Close it, maybe? Okay, now it lets me close it. It didn't before. <sighs> what do you want? You want me to open the bottom one? No? Yeah, okay, I know about that. I can pull it out. I don't know what down you want. Him? I can't open anything below it. Maybe if we switch it to two? Now what do we get? Okay. It's still pointing downwards. I don't know what else you want. Under the drawer? 
Is it supposed to be under the drawer? Okay, it's supposed to be under the drawer. I just can't quite get there. There we go. There we go. Now I can get there. Okay, giant water bug. Uh, I love the camera in this game. Hi. All right, I am assuming the small metal handle goes to the lock over here. Yes. A small metal handle. No. Okay. Uh. Where have I seen the need for a small metal handle? Gotta have been somewhere, right? Used that, used everything up there. We're missing the beetle here. But otherwise we're good. Uh, used this area. The only thing I can think of is somewhere on the box. But I don't have anywhere to stick a handle in. Uh, no, it's not the crank on the side of the table. Is it this thing? Is it this thing? Nope! Not in the least! Okay, what do you got? Handle I've collected. Looks like one I've used recently. The drawer? You want me to change the drawer handles? Ah, I wasn't trying to back out. I was trying to move. No, it's not the drawer handles. What? Okay, so you want me to use it? Oh, okay. Oh, I guess it does look like this one. Oh, okay, fine, fair. Oh boy. Okay, it's a decent look. Um, fun choice. Okay. Okay, oh wait, 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 wait. The thing said um, zero and Vs, right? So it should be that? Yes. Okay, good, good, good. I'm not completely useless at these games. Just mostly. Cool. I can deal with mostly useless. Okay. So... Can I do anything with said key? Doesn't look like it. What did they say? The keyhole shape doesn't match the key. But it let me use it, which means there's gotta be something I can do here, right? but it's not letting me spin it in any way, shape, or form. There's nothing on this key to manipulate. 
Am I reforging it? Are we cutting a new key? Um, do we have a different lock somewhere? That's the only lock I can remember. No, not not the table. Not the table, thank you. Um, we did the drawer. There's no locks over here. Uh, okay. Let me riddle it out for a second here. There's no locks over here. The only thing I can think of is the one lock on the beetle. Am I just being a dumb? Yeah, okay, I knew it, right? It is supposed to go to the padlock on the table. I'm not being a dumb. But the shape isn't right. So it's got to be that we manipulate the key somehow, but it's not letting me. Can I pull it? It's got an up arrow. Can we pull it up at all? No? Is there a way to break it in half and separate it? Oh! This thing has rotatable sections. Oh. Okay. That I didn't know was rotatable. At this top section, it's this top section. It needs to be an arrow. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. Thank you. Can I move on? Can I get out, please? Thank you. I know exactly where the stag beetle goes now that you've let me actually grab it. Okay. So then, now, can I change this? Yes, now I can change this. Now it goes here. Okay, cool. Cool. And then this. Hello! Goes... Where are we going? Right here. Yes? Yep! Cool, we get a new eyepiece. A lens that looks like it would fit my eyepiece. Yay! I was gonna read the letter. <clears throat> Welcome! It seems to be my fate to be forever standing on the shoulders of greater men. Montfaction's work here makes mine appear that of a child. <laughs> uh, but he never cracked that final secret to the door as I have. He carried with him the key all along, and he never realized that the soul is the root of the null. It comes down to a simple trade, mine for hers, and hers for yours. The heart is the seat of the soul. Travel well, and don't look back. Whatever you see, whatever you see here, don't look back. Okay, okay cool. Uh... Got a green lens now. And the guy we're following went a little nuts. He kind of started scrawling on the walls. Okay. So it's got to be something with the new 
lens, right? Because we just got this lens, it's got to be something to do with the new lens. But I don't know what he wants. Other than for me to see that you have gone completely and totally bonkers. And went scribbling all over the room. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh, so this one and then th three three I don't... I don't get it. We're saying start here and go around the circle, I guess? That doesn't make any sense, though. No. See, that would be too easy. I... don't get it. Is it more around the room, maybe? Did he... Okay, so one is the triangle above the freaky eye. Okay. And three is the eye, so that just leaves two. So that's easy enough. I can do that. So one is this. Three is this. So then that just leaves two, which is the others. Okay, cool, cool, good, we could do that. Okay. I turned on the machine. Oh, we're going through the electrified door. I nice that's nifty that's just great actually um, there's a beautiful staircase over here can we go up that so I think that's a staircase I see a staircase over there it won't let me do anything else like it won't let me zoom out this is all I get. It won't let me interact with this. There we go. Now it lets me interact. Oh boy, here we go. Okay. How about that door? That door looks nice. Can we go there? door am I aiming for then? Okay. Let's do it this way. Okay. I can't click out of it at any time, so none of the so it is find the correct door. That one looks nice. I'm down with that one. No. Well, we're almost to the end of the doors here. Okay, it'll let me look around this way. But it won't let me do anything else but play with the doors. Ah. Yeah, okay, that's a 
sound and a half. All right. Dial's on the table. I just need to find the right door. Okay, but which door is supposed to be the right door? I've been through them all, buddy. I would love it if you could tell me which is the right door. Is it me? Am I supposed to find the door and then click on it? Alright, let's try that as a theory. Alright, what do you say? Oh, perhaps the eyepiece can help me with the right door. Okay. Are we supposed to be matching? Okay. Okay, I see what they want. Got it! See, I told you that door looked nice and pleasant. Ah! Uh, guys, the Kraken's here! Run! Hey guys, it's the Kraken! Oh, he blew up the house. Congratulations, you have completed the room two. Where many have faltered, you have succeeded in discovering the mysteries hidden within this most unique space. You fled the laboratory and escaped the confounded house where it all began. After much scientific study, I can only conclude that it is an absolute impossibility that the null sample under my custody is the only one in existence. It stands to reason that there must be a great number of somehow coordinated samples which exert some form of control over the curious events. Okay, cool. So I completed it and we escaped. Woo! Thank you for playing and purchasing the room too. We hope you enjoyed it. Aw. As small independent game developers, we truly believe in the power of word of mouth and goodwill from everyone who plays our games, so please let us know what you thought. The room two is recommending Room Two by recommending or writing a review on the Steam page. Oh, it's actually really good. Um the controls get a little frustrating at times, but otherwise it's really good. It's really, really good. We sincerely value your support feedback by purchasing and or recommending the room too. Yeah, I mean, it's really good. Don't get me wrong. It frustrates me a little, but it's really good. And that one was actually quite a bit longer than the room one. So here's the plan because I have groceries coming in room to boot a half hour ish or so. I don't really have time to start up the room three, but I will set everything up to start up the room three tomorrow. And we will play through as much of the room three as I can get to tomorrow. How's that? I say, how's that? Like anybody has a choice, but me, I'm the only one here. So it's the only thing that matters. So we'll do the room three tomorrow and then we'll finish it up with the room four. And then we will be on to Crowns and Pawns. Crowns and Pawns, Kingdom of Deceit. After that, maybe we'll do Nancy. Maybe we'll do something else. I don't know. I've been wanting to do a Nancy Drew playthrough, though, of all the Nancy Drew games. For, well, all of them that I have, I'm missing like three games, which is kind of annoys me because I know I've played them, but I'm missing the digital files, which is super annoying super annoying the other really annoying part is like I am 90% positive I can recover those digital files 
but they're all on a hard drive that died probably about two years ago, along with a lot of my family photos. So yeah, yeah, it's a little annoying. But anyway, getting off of that, we're going to be coming back tomorrow with the room three. I hope you guys have a great day. I hope you're having a great time. I actually do like the room. I know I'm probably relying on hints a little bit more than some people would like, but I mean, when I get stuck, I get stuck. That's just life. So I kind of like it. It actually makes me feel a little bit smarter than I think I am. <laughs> All right. Well, I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.